So in this question, we're looking to calculate the speed of a wave. Now it says we've got a frequency, so I'm just gonna write that down. So the frequency is equal to 7.9 times 10 to the 14 Hertz. So that's a really high frequency wave. And it says the wavelength is equal to 380 nanometers. Now you don't need to know at GCSE what a nanometer is. And actually in the question, it says that one nanometer is one times 10 to the minus nine meters. So even though this might be new information, it explains that new information in the question. So the wavelength is gonna be equal to 380 times 10 to the minus nine. Now that's not the normal way of writing down standard form. We'd normally put 3.8 times 10 to the something, but that's an acceptable way for when we're gonna be entering this data into our calculator. Now what we're trying to find out is the speed, and we know f and we know lambda, and then we're gonna use the equation that says the wave speed is equal to the frequency multiplied by the wavelength. So that's just gonna be equal to these two numbers multiplied together, so 7.9 times 10 to the 14, multiplied by 380 uh, times 10 to the minus nine. Uh, you can't really do this in your head. Well, I, I can't anyway, definitely. So uh, 7.9 times 10 to the 14, multiplied by 380 times 10 to the minus nine. Again, that's a big number, so I'm gonna write this in standard form. And I'm gonna give it to, in this case, two significant figures, like my raw data here. So that's equal to 3.0, um, and then that's raised to the power of 10 to the one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And because this is our wave speed, uh, the units are meters per second. In actual fact, this number should be quite familiar to you by now. This is the speed of light or the speed of electromagnetic waves. In actual fact, um, something which has a wavelength of 380 nanometers, that's just into the ultraviolet uh, range. So here I've got uh, an ultraviolet torch. Um, it causes certain things to fluoresce. Uh, and so um, in this particular case, we've got ultraviolet light which travels at the speed of all electromagnetic waves, which is three times 10 to the eight meters per second.